An interesting scene in late spring 2020 along the Fort Morgan Peninsula. Sherry Darby was looking out over the Gulf and noticed water with two different textures and colors with that browner water moving toward the east. What was going on there? We'll start with the satellite view and the satellite view shows the entire Earth. But when you look really closely, you'll notice along a lot of the bays along the central Gulf Coast that particular day you see brown going out into the Gulf of Mexico. That is sediment. It's runoff from rivers that are inland that drain toward the Gulf of Mexico. And the day before Sherry shot the video, you see a lot of brown in Mobile Bay going into the Gulf and then turning mostly toward the east before going back to the west. The day she shot the video, same story. And literally, this is a current of fresh water, not clean water, but fresh water as opposed to salty water that goes out into the Gulf of Mexico, and sometimes it doesn't mix that quickly. So what she saw was the edge of fresh water meeting salty water, and it turns out that fresh water is less dense than salty water, so it kind of floats on the top of the salty water. It's called a tide line, even though it's really not a tide, but it is certainly a line, and sometimes it can be pretty dramatic. This video I shot a couple of years ago, in the air and it shows the same sort of uh, pattern and that is air can have different density. In this case you have alto cumulus clouds with a really sharp edge just kind of moving along not mixing with the other air and again it's all about a difference in density. So a tide line very fascinating very interesting and not totally unusual. I'm Chief Meteorologist Alan Seals.